Airsoft GI would like to thank our sponsors. Hi GI TV, I'm Bob the Angst Man Hildebrand here to talk to you about something kind of cool today. Now, if you're familiar with the 1911 Mark series from KWA, you're going to know that the, the magazines for them only hold 14 rounds. Well, very recently, KWA just released 21 round magazines for their 1911 Mark series. That's an advantage of 50% more rounds within new magazines. That's quite a bit of capacity. Um, now, there actually are some parts that come with these that you'll have to install to get your 1911 Mark series to accommodate the new magazines. Uh, but they've basically just made a more efficient use of space to stack more rounds in this magazine, and I couldn't be more delighted. Now, it not, may not be as beneficial for those of you that already own a lot of single stack magazines for 1911 because you will have to convert to these new parts like a new slide catch and a new magazine release. But if you're like me and you only have one mag for your 1911 Mark series, this will probably be very beneficial in the long run if you want to switch over the 21 round magazines right now. So without further ado, let's go to the tech table and see how it's done. All right, so we're almost ready to begin installation of the new KWA 1911 Mark Series 21 round magazine. Now the first thing we're gonna do is make this gun safe to work with. First of all, we're gonna release the magazine. This is the original 1911 Mark Series magazine. Um, we're also gonna chamber check this 1911 Mark II. All right, we seem to be good to go. Now here's the new 1911 Mark Series magazine, the 21 rounder. Uh, also included in this package uh, is obviously uh, the bag it comes in, which is really nice. And you also get a handy dandy instruction manual. And it's always very important to read the instructions before you work on anything, on anything mechanical. And thankfully these instructions are very simple and easy to read, uh, so much so that I'm able to do this only reading the instructions once. Uh, you're also going to get a couple other pieces, a new, uh, new slide catch, as, a, as well as a new magazine release, and an Allen key to help install the magazine release. Uh, it's a very simple process. You're essentially going to move the slide back until the groove matches up with the slide catch. Then you're going to proceed to the other side of the gun, the right side, and you're going to press the button that's connected to the slide catch to press it out. Now you're going to want to make sure when you remove this that you want to keep it in a bag or somewhere safe so in case you want to switch back to your old magazines you'll still have this piece and you won't have to reorder it. So installing the new slide catch is very simple. You just make sure the groove is still lined up with the slide and you're going to pull the slide all the way back and release it and you'll be good to go for the slide catch. Now we are going to flip this gun over and move on to the magazine release which is right here. You'll see there's a little uh, area where you can insert your Allen key do that right now and you're going to want to depress it and turn it counterclockwise. Alright, now we're going to push the new model in. All right. So we've got it in, the magazine release is set, you should be good to go with your new KWA Mark Series 1911 21 round magazine. Just insert it and you're right as rain.